Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are doing some makeovers. <laughs> Specifically everyone in my legacy challenge that needs a makeover. There's a couple of them and I thought might as well do it in one video rather than doing it during a legacy like let's play video because it just like eats up time where we can be getting stuff done if that makes any sense at all i hope it does so yeah we're gonna give a makeover to rotheo we're gonna give a makeover to felix's kids we're also going to update luna um because we haven't given her a makeover since she was like a teen and then whoever else i can think of i guess we'll just like get a couple of things done for this let's play today so i'm excited i'm stoked to hang out with you guys i don't have a celsius today i've got some guava Bund bundaberg I hope I'm pronouncing that right, but I've got it in my cup. <laughs> so cheers to you, cheers to this video. Let's get into it. All right, you guys, I thought we could start off with Miss Rotheo here. I'm sorry if you guys can hear the vacuum in the background. I feel like my family is always vacuuming or hair drying or whatever while I'm trying to stream or film videos, um, so I apologize. But once I moved in, move into my apartment, it should be a lot quieter. <laughs> so she's one of our adopted beans. She just aged up into a child. She is so, so cute. Um, I definitely wanna give her the same hair that she had when she was a little bean. It was this one, or was it this one? Or was it this one? Oh no, I think it was this one. And then we also gave her like the, brown tips which i thought were really cute so i do want to keep that going maybe we could give her something fun now that she's a kid maybe she just wants to like start experimenting with color and like discover her own style so i don't know maybe we should do like a fun color the turquoise is really nice i always tend to gravitate towards <laughs> towards turquoise things um ooh, the ooh, wait 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 the purple though the purple was super nice hi olive Oh, she's gonna make a nest. You guys wanna watch? Oh, she ended up doing it. Okay, that's fine. It must have been comfy the way it is, huh, Olive? Yeah, the purple is a whole mood. Let's do that. Okay, now let's move on to the skin details. I did it backwards this time. I usually do skin details first. Ah! Uh... Dun dun dun. Anyone get like a burst of energy after they sneeze? Or is it just me? So this weekend, uh, Monday actually, but we're leaving Sunday, uh, the movers come and move in all of my furniture from the storage unit into my apartment. I'm very excited because I haven't really been able to do anything to the apartment yet just because there's no furniture in there. And I don't know like how everything is gonna fit. I'm a little nervous because my couch is my couch is big. Like I wanted a big couch with a big chase. So um, yeah, I'm a little scared that it's gonna be awkward in my new apartment because my apartment's like long and skinny. But we'll see how it goes. I'm excited. I'm excited to decorate. I'm excited to go to like Home Goods and Target and stuff. Um, I will be vlogging the entire experience. I uploaded a vlog today and I also uploaded one last week. I've been on a roll with vlogs, so if you guys are interested in like watching like my personal life type of stuff, um, my vlog channel is just Lady Sav. I'll put it on the screen and I'll also link it down below if you would like to watch. I'm trying to get YouTube partner over there so that I can um, monetize my videos, so it would help me out a lot if you could uh, go subscribe and watch. <clears throat> I really appreciate the support. Vlogging has been so much fun lately because like everything near me has been kind of going back to normal because the cases are so low so i'm no longer just vlogging from my room anymore um i'm actually like doing things which is fun uh makes for definitely for better vlog content i'm not trying to put lipstick on her i'm just trying to find one that's like very close to her skin tone that one works oh my god she's such a cutie i love her I love her so much. Okay, let's find her something to wear now. Mm, I don't know, what would her style be? Maybe she can be like a girly girl because we don't really, again, we don't have very many girly girls in the family. Aw, that striped shirt though. Okay, I, I'm immediately like thinking maybe not. Wow, that's base game? Oh my God, the colors on that are so nice. What the heck, I love this shirt. Okay, I'm gonna do that for one outfit and then we can find, ooh, with the, ooh, with the orange capris. I mean, sheesh, that's sick. Or even just orange, like, long pants. 
Oh man. Or what are these? These have patches on them? Oh, they have little roller skates. Maybe she can be a, like a roller skating bean. Aw, I think I like the orange pants though. That outfit is fire. I would wear that 100%. <laughs> I know it's bright, but like it's bright in the best way. Oh, she's so cute. And now there's people yelling outside. I swear, I can't get like a moment of peace. Okay, that's like so cute. What the heck? I love her. <laughs> so cute okay okay i'm noticing that my style in the sims is pretty minimal but a lot of you guys tell me that you like the way that i dress my sims and things like that i guess if you didn't like it you probably wouldn't watch my videos but <laughs> i always have so much self-doubt just because it's so minimal but i just need to accept that that's just like what i like you know you know what i mean jelly bean okay here's her cute little formal wear let's do active wear next whoa why the glasses this is funny this shirt this is a marshmallow roasting a marshmallow that's pretty uh that's pretty morbid that's from a sims pack too <laughs> okay there's her little active wear Full sleeps. Mm, I want that um, gorilla CC for kids. That one night outfit that I always use. I want it for children. Okay, here is little Bean's party outfit. Very cute. For swim, I just like to give them the wetsuits. I think they're really cool. This is adorable. The butt's clipping a little bit, but like that's something that I could ignore. <laughs> oh, that's cute. I just need to change the pants. Let's do... Uh... Yeah. Do we like these boots? I actually kind of like these boots. Doesn't look too bad. I never use these boots either. They're from cats and dogs. Or should we do these? Mmm. Shoot. Let's do those. All right, you guys. Well, this is Miss Rotheo's makeover. I hope that you enjoyed it. I originally wanted a more girly aesthetic, but maybe we can do that when she ages up into a teen or something. I love this hair so much. Aw, look at these two. Absolutely iconic. Am I right? Look at these fits. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't think anyone else in the house needs a uh, makeover at the moment. So let's head on over to Felix's house, shall we? Oh, what a night. What a beautiful night. I have no... Oh my God, there's a... <gasps> you guys, there's another child. Oh my God, they had another kid. I'm so excited right now. Um, hi, what is your name? <gasps> it's a girl, Melissa, Melly, bands make her dance. <laughs> okay, let's go into cast and give uh, the their, all their little beans a makeover. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Actually, hang on, hold on a minute. I wanna check the calendar. I wanna see how long the twins are going to be children for, because if they're like aging up into a teen in the next few days, I'm just gonna age them up because giving them a makeover would be pointless. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, they're gonna be kids for a while. All right, fair enough. All right, let's start with William. He has the artistic prodigy um, aspiration and the insider trait. He's got purple eyes. I see a lot of Felix in him, a ton. He's a handsome boy, like I can already tell super super handsome okay i like that those lashes i like the brows too <gasps> so now we just have to choose a hair for him like i said in my previous video or which video was that i think it might have been my <clears throat> 100 baby video i said i needed more um children hair like for boys because i'm tired of seeing the same ones and i'm sure you guys are too here he is with felix's hair Kind of a spitting image as when Felix was a kid, huh? Okay, this is what I have so far. I love the way that his beanie matches his eyes. <laughs> this is a cutie, okay. Oh, that looks pretty dope. Is there a matching color? <gasps> Ooh, I mean, hmm, it's pretty far out, huh? What about this? That's kind of cute. Okay, that's an option. I find it a little weird when kids are insiders. It doesn't really make sense to me. 
But the way that I see it is they're like... She just totally ate crap off my bed. Anyway, as I was saying, <laughs> they seem to be kind of like popular kids at school that know everything, that have like the inside scoop on whatever. So maybe that's what William is. I don't know. I'm like desperate to create a storyline for him in my head and that's what I've come up with. Okay, so here's his everyday. Um, I don't need to give him a formal. I just need to get rid of all of this like nonsense that he's wearing and just put him in something normal. Um, there you go. We don't see these kids that often, so it's not necessary. Oh, that's a cute hair, actually. It's not necessary to give him every outfit, but <clears throat> here we are. Okay, here's this cold weather. Quick little hot weather, swim, party, sleep, active, and formal. Okay, William. Well, aren't you just a little cutie? Let's see if your brother is an identical twin, shall we? I can already tell they're not actually from their thumbnails. <laughs> Boop. Hi. Okay, so you also have purple eyes. Um, I don't think we're going to give him heterochromia because the other bean, Melissa, has heterochromia. He looks more like Kay, which is very interesting. Oh, I forgot to tell you, he has the WizKid aspiration and he, and he has the geek trait. Okay, so he's going to be a little smarty pants. I can appreciate that. I was in party wear. Oh my god, I'm annoyed. <laughs> Maybe we should give him Felix's hair, actually. One of them has to have it. <laughs> it's like a little rite of passage. <laughs> I don't get this. Like, what is this? Why is this even allowed? It shouldn't even be allowed. Oh my God. All right, y'all. Here is his everyday outfit. I love this colorway of this uh, outfit from Parenthood. It's so cute. Here's his formal, nothing special. His athletic, his sleep, his party wear, his swim. Here's his hot weather outfit. This is a whole mood. And his cold weather. I love this. I love the pastels. Let's give Felix a new outfit as well. Something a little bit more dad, I suppose. There you go, sir. Definitely looking a little bit more fatherly. Love him. I miss you. I hope you're doing good, sir. Is it Melissa or Melissa or Meliza? Because there's only one S. I'm confused, but she's fussy. So that's fun. All right, let's have a look at you, Bean. Let me change the brows because they're like throwing everything off. <laughs> look at those cheeks. Have you ever seen a bigger, bigger cheeks on a toddler? Dang. I'm very excited for this Bean, though. I have no doubt she's going to be beautiful. She has good jeans. She does have a bit of a hamburger hamburger head though already. <laughs> Look at this sweet bean, you guys. Oh my gosh. She's too cute. Okay, here's what I dressed her in. I found these like CC biker shorts. I thought were super cute. And then this shirt I think is base game. Oh no, it's Dream Home Decorator. Oh my God, that's so cute. I love it. I absolutely love it. I think she's, she's top tier cute. I can't believe they had another kid. How exciting. Okay, here's her formal. And then for her sleep, um, it really doesn't matter, does it? We're never gonna see it. I love the socks with sandals moment she's got going on here though. <laughs> this dress, the dream home decorator stuff for toddlers was actually really cute. I never got like a proper look at it, but this that dress is from it too. What are those? Scrunchies? <laughs> what hair does that go to? It fits on, on, on this hair. That's actually cute. <laughs> wow, what a cutie pie. Here's her hot weather outfit. And this is her cold weather. Actually, I think I'm gonna change the color of the boots to... Let's just do black. All right, y'all, here is Melissa. I hope that you like her. I think that's it for this family. Uh, next up, I think we're going to do May, which is, okay. Buckle up, because this is a uh, this is a uh, little bit confusing. <laughs> I'm already confused. Oliver's Oliver, who it was Olive's brother, Oliver, and his husband Zach adopted Kyla. Okay, Kyla got married to Alvin, and Alvin and her had a daughter named May, who is still alive. And I do want to give her a makeover because she is part of the family. And then we'll do Luna right after that. 
Let me find her. All right, you guys, here she is. I don't know if you remember her from the last Legacy episode, but she was at our party, which is why she's still in her party wear. <laughs> so I have not given her a makeover. She is a, is she a teen? Yeah, she's a teen. Okay, and she's living all by herself in San Maishuno, which is a little bit sad, but both of her parents died. So she doesn't really have a choice. But um, Kyla was... Kyla was brunette, I believe, or was she blonde? I'm pretty sure she was brunette. And then her dad, Alvin, was um, a ginger. So maybe we can give Kyla, or May, I mean, we can give her like, um, like kind of like an auburn color hair and see how that looks. Oh, wow. Fleur looks amazing on her. Wow. That was like night and day. Love a good skin detail, am I right, y'all? <laughs> okay, let's find her hair. I'm gonna take off uh, all this nonsense though so we don't get distracted. Uh, maybe I'm the only one who's like that, but <laughs> when the Sims have clothes on, it just distracts me when I'm doing their like skin details and their hair and stuff, so. All right, let's see. Wow. What a freaking smoke show, holy crap. She's so pretty. Oh my God, okay, this is gonna be hard. Um, let's see. Ooh. Ooh, that's pretty. Hmm. What is she, by the way? She wants to be a musical genius. She's a muser and a recycled disciple. Okay, she's, she's very musical. That's pretty cute. Oh, this bun. That's gorgeous. That's cute too. Oh no. Oh my God. Wow. Okay. I think we're going to do this one. I'm going to put uh, the baby hairs that I have. Let's see. Um, Which ones do we want to do? Okay. I think I like those. Yeah. That looks really nice. She's so pretty. Uh, she kind of has RBF, but like in the best way. You know what I mean? <laughs> I wish I knew how to explain it, but I don't. She seems like the type that would like, I don't know, wear cool makeup all the time. Let me see. Let me see if I have anything that looks pretty dope. This is really cool. I like the, the shape of it. Look at this flower eyeshadow. <laughs> it makes your eyes look more droopy than they actually are, so they're not very flattering, but I love the eyeshadow. It's so cute. With some of these, I'm just like, you have no right looking that, <laughs> looking that good. <laughs> I really like this one. I think it looks cool. Chef's kiss, am I right? Just a big old giant kiss from a chef. <laughs> Holy cannoli. Okay. Yeah, looking good so far. Let's put let's throw some earrings on her. I haven't used these in a while. The orange earrings. <laughs> I think they're cute. Okay, let's uh let's find her something to wear now. I'm kind of vibing a dress. She looks amazing in everything. I'm getting angry. She's looking very mature for her age though. Um so I'm kind of looking for something that's a little bit more it's too peoply out there. That's a mood. Uh a little bit more like youthful, I guess. Oh gosh, decisions, decisions. Ooh! Ooh, hold up. Wait a minute. This is cute. Hold up. Wait a minute. Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. I know I'm mixing Alpha and Maxis Match CC, but sometimes it looks okay. To me, this is fine. To me, this looks intentional. Wow. All right, then. You That outfit shows you. You didn't choose that outfit. That's all I gotta say. Active wear. Sleepwear, you get the full body, yaddy, yaddy, yaddy. Maybe living in Samai Shuno all her life got her very into fashion, what's trendy, all that good stuff. <gasps> Wait, I know what I want to put her in. Where's that velvet dress by Trillike? That is one of the most impressive pieces of CC that I've ever seen in my life. It's so. Holy cannoli. Like the texture is like unreal. Like how, how did you even do, do it? Where is it? Is it this one? Okay, yeah, it is. Like, wow. Wow, wow, wow. This is such a cute outfit, I can't. I can't deal with it. Okay, there's her party. For swim, um, 
I'm definitely not going to be wearing platform sandals. Love that. I need to delete this butterfly CC. It's literally on every sim and it's killing me. <laughs> Cute. Oh. Love that. Wow. This, this outfit. Hmm. Wow. It's like the game purposely finds the stuff that won't go good together and puts it on all at once. Sorry, I keep venting about that because I'm like, I'm like shook at the, the combinations of some of these outfits. <laughs> Can't help it. You'd think I would be used to it by now, but I'm really not. Let's put her hair down with this one and let's put it in these, um, the poof balls that I used to have when I was a kid <laughs> and put a beanie on her, um, or beret. I like the beanie action. That's cute. All right. So here's her cold weather. Here's her hot weather. Here's her swimwear, her party wear, her sleep, her, uh, athletic wear. Um, I think I might, should we change her hair for this one so that we can see it? There we go. That's cute. Okay. Her formal, um, I actually wanted to put some blue liner for this outfit. Um, yeah, that's really pretty. Okay. And then here's her every day. All right, May, you are ready to take on the world, my love. Yeah. See, you guys remember this apartment? We came over here one time. Oh my god. I really want to play with her. <laughs> but I can't! She's popular? Good for you, my love. I'm glad you're, you're living your best life. Okay, and last but not least, we have Luna! Luna! I wanted to just give her a little update on her look. Uh, change her hair, probably. Give her some new outfits that are more... I don't want to say adult, but just a little bit more grown up. Maybe she's feeling more confident in herself now. Um, you know, maybe this is one of your guys' sims, <laughs> Julie Evans. Let me know in the comments if it is. Okay, Luna. Hello, my love. Let's find you a new hair, shall we? Wow, she is so pretty. This is going to be hard. I can already tell. Wow. Everything looks good. I don't know if you guys remember this, but Luna was blonde when she was born. She dyes her hair black. So we can always go back to blonde, but I just don't know if she would ever do that. When I tell you that I just went through every single one of my hairs, <laughs> I'm not lying. I think this is the one that I'm gonna do. I really like it. I was between that one and this one. This is really, really cute. I love how Leia Lilith has these like, <laughs> sorry, I have a frog in my throat, has these like gradient hairs and like, oh, look at this one too. Before she just had dyed tips, but now she can just like commit to a full head of Oof, I think I like the bangs better now that I'm like, yeah, I think we should do this one. She looks so cool. And I think that we should give her the other nostril pierced as well. Um, is it this one or this one? I think it was that one, right? Yes, okay. Oh my God, she looks so cool. She's everything that I aspire to be. <laughs> I'm going to tone down the eyeliner a little bit as well. Maybe just like that. She's amazing. She is chef's kiss. Now let's find her something to wear. All right, y'all. This is what I landed on. I am so obsessed with her. I don't think y'all understand this outfit. Ugh. It's so her, but I feel like she's just more comfortable with who she is. And so she's taking like bolder. She's doing like making bolder choices, which I'm obsessed with. Love this outfit, outfit so freaking much. Um, I just got to change the rest of her outfits now and I'll show you when I'm done. But yeah, 
I'm satisfied. I hope that you guys like it. Okay, here is her formal. Here is her athletic. Here's her sleep. Here's her party. Here's her swim. Here's her hot weather and cold weather. Okay. I hope that y'all are satisfied. I know how many of you guys love her, so <laughs> I'm a little scared. <laughs> Let's go check in on Alice. I'm gonna graduate her from uni as well and move her into Selva Dorada because she I don't I don't think she's gonna graduate on her own, which is kind of frustrating. Okay, let me see if I can figure out how to do this. I think I have to cheat some info, expansion sheets, university cheats, graduate now. Okay. Okay, so you are graduated, so let's go ahead and move you. I'm technically not supposed to do this. Like in Legacy Challenge, you're not supposed to play any other family except for your own. I don't know if I would count this as playing though. I'm kind of just like progressing the story along, you know what I mean? <laughs> okay, so I can move her to Selva Dorada, right? Can I really not? Hold on, let me Google it. Oh, I need a mod for it. Okay, okay. So that's something that I'm just gonna have to do off camera. So no problem. As long as we got her graduated, I'll download this mod and then I'll move her into Selva Dorada off camera. I guess that's it then, you guys. I don't think there's anything else that I need to do as far as like makeovers go. I just need to do that thing with Alice and then give Bruce his uh, actor career. And that's it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this little uh, makeover video. Let me know if you want me to do more of these, like when we need to do um, like a bunch of makeovers at once. Just let me know if you prefer having a separate video or if you like seeing them like in the actual Let's Play video. It will help me out a lot if you can give me your opinion. I love you guys so, so much and I will see you in my next video. Follow me on Instagram and TikTok and don't forget to follow my vlog channel. I love you so much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.